And thanks for joining us. Developing tonight, the feds have launched a civil rights investigation into the Mount Vernon Police Department over allegations of discriminatory policing. News 12's Jonathan Gordon is outside Mount Vernon Police Headquarters tonight. Jonathan, this is a city where half the department is black as police, yet they're being accused of targeting black residents. So that might surprise a lot of people. Did the mayor address that? Well, yes, she did. She says that really it's been a failure of leadership for quite a long time, but she said it is a failure that she is willing to change. Just because you have black leadership does not always mean that you have leadership that is committed to transforming police departments. The mayor of Mount Vernon pulled no punches against her own police department after the feds levied serious misconduct allegations against them. Officers are accused of using excessive force, conducting unlawful strip searches, falsifying evidence, and racially targeting black residents. When officers break the law, they violate their oath and undermine a community's trust. Mayor Patterson Howard acknowledged the department is understaffed, underpaid, and has its problems, but added she's committed to working with the DOJ. We welcome the Department of Justice again, coming in with their resources to help us as a community. City leadership has spent time reviewing and changing police protocols over the last two years, and their optimistic investigators will see that. I believe that most of the um, past practices have been eliminated. Earlier this year, Westchester District Attorney Mimi Roca called on the feds to look into the department. So Jonathan, what are the next steps in this investigation? Well, investigators will speak with police officers and community members. They'll review evidence like body cam footage and internal documents inside of police headquarters. And then they'll issue a public report if they find some wrongdoing. And if that is the conclusion, then they'll work with Mount Vernon to try and come to an agreement and uh, make some changes. Now, if there is no agreement, a lawsuit could be on the way. But everyone here from the top down is hoping it doesn't get that far.